Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can add a new interpreter in PyCharm project. So we will create this for a new project and we'll also see how we can change the Python interpreter or add the Python interpreter in an existing project. So first open your PyCharm and let's say you are trying to do this for a new project. So you will click on this main menu and click on new project. Here when you're creating your project, you get to choose the name, the location and the interpreter type. So I'll just call this my new project. Now you can also change the location of the project from this to any other directory. I'll just leave it as it is. Okay. And then you get to choose interpreter type. So project VENV, base conda or custom environment. So if you choose project VENV, this Python version, that is the default install Python version in your system will be used and a new virtual environment will be created in this directory. So here, as you can see, C users, your username, your project folder, and your project name. Inside this project folder, virtual environment will be created for you using this 3.1, 3.2. This is the Python version installed. If you also have Conda installed, you can use the base Conda installation, or you can create a custom environment anywhere that you want. So a standard practice is to just create a VENV or virtual environment inside your root directory. So this is what we'll be going to do. And just click on create. Now your project is being created. And as you can see, the virtual environment is being created for your project. So this is the standard practice that is to create the virtual environment inside the project directory. Now let's see how we can change the virtual environment or add a new Python interpreter in your already existing project. So now the project is created and this is the virtual environment created for this my new project. You can now create a new Python file here. Let's call it main.py or whatever you want. And here you can write your Python code. And when you run this, the modules and the Python from this .env, that is your virtual environment will be used. So this Python version is also shown here. So you can quickly see which Python is being used. So if I click on this, you get to change Python interpreters from here. Now, if you hover over this, you can see the path of this Python that is inside the virtual environment. Now, if you already have a project, let's see how we can add or change Python interpreter for this project. So let's say you have a project. Now what you can do is you can just click on this menu button again, click on settings, and here you will see these options, appearance and behavior, key map editor, and so on. Just click on project and then your project name. Here you will see project structure and Python interpreter. Now click on Python interpreter here. The currently selected Python interpreter will be shown. So this is the Python interpreter being used from our virtual environment. Now what you can do is you can just click on add interpreter, add local interpreter, and you can select an existing interpreter. This is the one that's already being used, or you can create a new interpreter from any base interpreters. You can create a new virtual environment in any location, or you can choose an existing interpreter. So this is selected that is virtual env this means that a new virtual environment will be created now if you want to use the default python version that is installed in your system with all the default packages you can just click on system interpreter so as you can see the default python interpreter for our system is anaconda3 python.exe so if you click on ok this will be used but if you want to use a virtual environment which is the standard practice this is already being used if you want you can delete this and create a new one okay so this is how you can add or change python interpreter in pycharm project if you have any questions let me know in the comments below